guys, welcome back. I'm going to jump right in. I'm using the Too Faced Sweet Peach Palette. I'm going in with Candied Peach first, which is a really nice, light, peachy shade, uh, obviously. And I'm just going to buff that all over my crease and lid, and then I'm going to jump in to Puree. And this is a more warm, um, just like a light brown, and I'm just going to build that color on there. This is a really easy look, honestly. I was just wanting to do something basic that made me feel pretty. Sometimes I feel like on YouTube I need to try to do different looks all the time, and sometimes I just want to do my go-to, something that makes me feel confident, so this is kind of that look. Very simple, um, still glittery and glam, but just very simple. So I'm going in with Charmed, I'm sure, which is the dark brown, and I'm just going to add some depth, but again, this is really easy. You can do any colors on your lid, just a matte brown in the crease and you're good to go. So to add a pop to the lid, I'm using this Magnificent Metal from Stila. This is their really intense eyeshadows. This is in Metallic Pixie Dust. I'm going to apply this to the lid. I really love these shadows. Uh, I just spray my brush with Fix Plus and then apply them and they stay all night and they're just really dramatic and just kind of catch the light. So I really love these. I think I own almost all of them. So just apply that to your lid. Then I'm taking some Urban Decay liner. It's glitter liner and I'm applying it right into that crease. I just want to try it and just give me a little bit more of a wow factor to this look. So I'm applying that to my crease and then I'm going to do a wing. You guys know I love a wing. A wing makes me feel confident. I feel like it just completes the look a lot of the time. And I'm using my Artist of Makeup liner pen as usual. I just, this one is just now like drying out and I've had it for literally I think six months plus. So I ordered another one so hopefully that'll be here soon. But I'm just going to do the typical wing and then I'm going to go in with these lashes from Huda Beauty. These are a staple for me as well. Uh, Huda Beauty Samantha lashes. They're just really pretty. Uh, those in Scarlet are my favorite. Scarlet being a lot more dramatic. So these are the more wearable uh, ones from Huda and I just think they're really pretty and wispy. Now I'm going in with concealer. I've been loving this shape tape from Tarte. I know I've spoke about it before, but it really is amazing. And then you see me kind of cleaning up the edges of my wing. So definitely do that if you don't have any shadow underneath. And then I'm using a damp beauty blender to really blend everything in. This concealer is extremely high coverage, but it doesn't crease. And it's, uh, it's almost moisturizing. It's not greasy. It's just not dry and cracky. I just really, really love it. Then I'm going to set my under eyes with Laura Mercier translucent powder as usual and we're going to bake and then I'm going to go in to my Tarte uh, Confidence Creamy Foundation. Really love this formula. I think this is a neutral medium and I'm using that damp uh, beauty blender to really just stipple that onto the rest of my face to set it. That's a good trick if you want your makeup to last longer. And now I'm going in with the Tardis Contour Palette. Wow, I've been loving a lot of Tarte products lately, I feel like. Uh, using that Makeup Geek brush, I really like it. It really carves out my cheekbones, and it gives me that sharp contour, which you guys know I love. So I'm just going to apply that um, to give me a slimmer face. And then I'm going in with my Refined Golden from MAC, one of my favorites. I just ordered Give Me Sun, and I don't think I've tried that. I know a lot of YouTubers love it, so I'm going to give that one a go. But this is my Holy Grail from MAC as of now. Then I'm going to wipe away all that powder. I'm using a Juvia's Place brush. Love these brushes for powder, foundation, anything like that. And now I'm going to go in with Jeffree Star Peach Goddess. I snapped about this, you guys. This is so beautiful. I'm falling more and more in love with it as like time goes on. I'm using a Morphe brush, and I am really just like packing this on. It's so beautiful. You'll see in the end, I'm just like super glowy. And then I'm going to go in with Tarte Flush. This is a really beautiful, just like baby doll pink flushed blush. I don't know. It's just so beautiful. You can see that glow there. Oh, I'm in love. So now I'm going to go in with this Makeup Revolution Rose Gold. This is like a spinoff from the Stila uh, Metallics. I could have just used the Stila. You can use any kind of inner corner highlight, but I just wanted to bring a little bit of light to the inner corners. I'm going to leave the bottom lash line bare. I just did a little tiny bit of liner and some mascara, but I'm not going to do any eyeshadow. I just really want to focus on the just the lashes and the wing. And I'm going to uh, line my lips right now. I'm using Natasha Denona. And then I'm going to go in with my lip stain as usual. I didn't put it on camera just because I've done it a million times. Now I'm going in with Tom Ford lipstick. I will put the name down below. And then I'm going to go over that with Lip Land Reezy. And that completes the look. I hope you guys enjoy. I know it was nothing crazy, but I hope you still love it. I love you guys. I'll see you in the next one.